Mauricio Pochettino threatens to walk out of a press conference in a joke to start his Chelsea career. Mauricio Pochettino started his first-ever Chelsea press conference at Cobham today with an unexpected bit of dry humor. He said that he hoped the associated journalists were nice to him, because he could walk out at any moment if they pushed him too far on anything. This presser, is not compulsory, is it? he asked, turning to his press officer with a twinkle in his eye. The joke didn't quite land, perhaps he delivered it a little too dry for a group who weren't quite expecting it. But the fact he's ready to step right and start things off with a joke shows that he's relaxed and reminds everyone that he's not new at this, he had many years at Tottenham and a year at Southampton before that. It may take him a while to get back in the groove of dealing with the tricky English media, but as he showed today, he's ready for it. As the transfer season continues, be sure to follow for the latest updates on Chelsea's exciting summer transfer activity. Pochettino explains how much influence he has on the club's transfers so far. Mauricio Pochettino is taking his first Chelsea press conference, and there were plenty of questions about the squad building going on at Stamford Bridge. Pochettino chose to make it very clear that he had had no involvement before his official start on the 1st of July, and ever since then had only been giving his opinions, not shaping decisions himself. I think it is better if I clarify the situation. When we met for the first time and agreed to start work in July, Lawrence and Paul represent the plans for the squad. They showed me the transition plan, they start to work, and the club start to work. It is doing a fantastic job and I am happy. From now, from the 1st of July, I am more involved, I want to work with them. Stuart and Win Stanley have been given the keys to the city and full faith is being put with them. Pochettino is happy so far, but surely he's been promised some major incoming activity to strengthen a threadbare squad. He made similar declarations on Mount, making it clear he had only had limited input on that decision too. When I talk about the future, it's about the players in the squad. He's a Manchester United player now. I don't know what happened in the past, we need to be focused on our players and move and try to build a nice story. It's nice to see a coach who is willing to work with what he has rather than always demanding new signings. Let's just hope those upstairs are making the right decisions for him. Please like the video and subscribe to the channel. Thank you all.